Okay, so I'm going to just make a quick video to show you how to close up holes in a model. So this is a Zogras model um, for Hero Escape. And if you zoom in down here on the tail, you can see that there's a hole down here. Uh, there's two holes here, and then there's one hole on the other side. Uh, these parts have been connected, but they they were uh, separated. Some parts uh, were some uh, faces were deleted to separate them, but there's still holes there. So what we're going to do is come up to the top left to object mode and go to edit mode. And that'll show you individual vertices. Now there's different ways to do it, and I'll do I'll do uh, two different ways. The first way I do is use use your right click on a vertice, and then you can hold down Control and you can click to a, a hold set and make sure it's a continuous path just around the perimeter. And then you keep going down. Maybe I choose over here, hold down Control, and so you can see that's still a complete path. And you come up to here. Now it's a fully complete circle. You want to make sure you don't have anything over here. No, that would be bad. So Control Z, get rid of that. You want to make sure it's just the perimeter. And then you do Control, uh, and then you do uh, F. Just press the F key, that's going to make a face. And then you're going to do Control T and turn it into triangles. So F to make the face, Control T, and look, it's all closed up. Now, if I come down here, um, also you can also hold down the shift key. Do you, you want, uh, no, see that that's the wrong part. So you want to come back up here and then I can hold down shift and do several times. Shift does not do a continuous path. All, uh, not all, control does a continuous path. But see now I clicked on the wrong one, control Z. But I'm going to show you something else. Click back over here. If you hold down the Alt key and click on a on a line, it actually will some uh, often if it it'll it'll make it follow all the complete uh, vertices and may close up and uh, show you the whole hole. Um, it doesn't always work um, because it counts how many vertices are next to each one and. So sometimes it'll go out way off. So you want to check to make sure you you got a good closed path, but that's a good closed path. So all I did was I come again. I just came over. I held down the Alt key and I right clicked on a line, and that picked the whole thing. And again, I do F and Control T. Now that one's closed. Now there's one over here too. It's a little bit harder to see. I don't know if. Alt will work here. So let's do Alt. And it looks like Alt worked. So then I can do Face, Control T, and now that's closed up too. And then if I want, I can go over to Sculpt Mode, go to Smooth, Smooth that, Smooth this, where the holes were. I don't think there's anything, but now let's check to make sure there's nothing else over here. It needs to be cleaned up. That's, I don't think that's a, I think that's just a double. Oh, it might be. So let's, I can't see where that vertice is going, so I'm going to do Z, go to wire, for, hold down Z, come over here to wireframe. Uh, I still can't see. Come back here. So I want to follow whatever this one goes to. Z goes to point right there. All right. So if you come over on this side, you notice there's a little bridge under there. So I'm going to get rid of this point. X vertices. X vertices. Now, I probably didn't need to clean this up, but since I was in here, now I can do my Alt, Face, Control T, and then one right here. Uh, let's do Alt again, see if that works. Alt, Face, Control T. And 
stand, back to smooth tool, sculpt. Well, that's something weird. I don't know. Let's go see what that is. Ah, there's an extra line there. So we got to go up to here. Instead of vertices, you can go up to the one next to it, which is line select. We're going to just select that line. X, edges. Now we got rid of the edges. Object mode. There we go. So I just cleaned up that little bit of uh, mess. It, it would have printed OK, uh, but it just makes a better model. So just wanted to show you that's quick, quickly how I clean up the holes. Um, again, uh, you can click up individual vertices. Um, you can uh, use the shift tool to click individual vertices. Um, so you can use shift tool to click individual ones. You can use a control to pick a, a continuous line of vertices um, from beginning to end. Or you can use the the all and click on a line and see if that makes a full circle, the enclosed circle. Uh, so, hope that helps and get some better models in the future. All right, thanks.